Hello and welcome to Install Liberate. Today we're taking a look at Ubuntu Budgie 17.04 Beta 1. A newcomer in the list of official Ubuntu flavors, it features the Budgie Desktop, originally developed for the Solus distribution. Budgie Desktop is built on top of the GNOME stack, but recent announcements stated that starting with the next release, Budgie will adopt the Qt 5 framework. The installer is what you would expect from an official Ubuntu flavor and after a couple of minutes we are ready to boot into Ubuntu Budgie. We are greeted by the welcome screen which is eager to show us everything we need to know to get started. That includes the software updates, device drivers, regional settings, we are offered to configure backups and firewall, configure users and a few performance and customization options. Browser choice is also presented to the user. Most popular options can be installed with one click. As usual, I decide to install Firefox whenever offered. Installation is done in under a minute and we move right along. Budgie Desktop features a modern notifications and applets panel, not unlike what we are used to in modern operating systems and even macOS and Windows. From the same panel we can adjust basic theming options, including fonts, which is a nice touch. Scrolling through the list of pre-installed applications, we see all the usual suspects when it comes to GNOME-based desktops. Geary Mail is the default mail client and transmission is available for torrent sharing. We also see LibreOffice as the default office suite, MPV as the default video player, Rhythmbox for music and Terminix is the default terminal application. The software center looks very slick and polished and will be a great tool for Linux newcomers as a gateway to discovering Linux software. The settings app is typical of what you might expect from a GNOME-based desktop. A consolidated place for all basic configuration options, be it hardware peripherals or desktop wallpaper. The default dark theme integrates well with most, if not all, applications. The light blue highlight color looks great on top of dark grey windows. The Arc GTK theme is one of the best looking themes available today and I've ended up using it myself many times before. The developers, however, are currently working on their own take on the theme as a signature look of their desktop. Budgie is a great addition to the family of official Ubuntu flavors. Ever since Budgie appeared on the scene as the desktop of the Solus distribution, it gained a lot of followers and it's nice to see it being integrated with Ubuntu. Budgie Flavor will be a great distribution for Linux newcomers as well as seasoned users with Ubuntu as their distro of choice who might be looking for a fresh look. As the cow says, subscribe to Instaliberate channel. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.